everyone, I'm Nessa, and this is Ceramic Shenanigans. Sorry I've been away from the studio for a little while. I know some of you have missed me, and I apologize for taking a while. Um, but I hope everyone's been having a good new year. Almost done with January, we're making it so far. And I thought I'd show you something that I got at the end of 2020. So this is a little mini pottery wheel. And I got it from my mama. Hi, mama. Thank you very much. It comes with a little lid, a power knobby thing back here that controls the speed, and I can control if it goes this way, it's going to put it this way or this way. And it also comes with a bunch of these nifty tools. So I figured I'd show you. I threw one just to make sure I could do it. So the second one is all for you. Let's see how it goes. Got to the side for now. Besides the nifty case, it comes with these handy tools. Let me crop it out for a second. Not these ones. These handy little sculpting tools. And these are mainly what I'm going to use to shape it. That's what seems to be so far. I really like this pointy one. It's pretty good. So, we get that. This handy lid. Wheel itself. See it better? It's pretty small, nice and compact, and you can make it go left or right, as I said. And then when you're all done with it, clean it first, obviously. I'm not doing that. And it's nifty and portable. So, let's get everything in place. Pop that over here. And we'll get started. Alright. Get my water here. Just clean this one up. Ball from this mentioned a minute ago. I'm gonna just press that on as close to center as I can. Press it really tight. I usually am used to pressing hard on the wheel. Let's try to focus you there. There we go. As you see, if I put too much pressure, one finger, even a pinky, is going to stop this. So we have the pressure from the top while also smoothing it out a bit. What's well, different from this compared to the regular pottery wheel is you're kind of going to use the tools more to shape it than you are wedging down and back up again. Use this finger. It kind of does. Eh, maybe not. So oh, I just want to press down and I can't. This tool here, and we're gonna drill down. And then open up with the round side. Too much, oh no.
so cute. All right. Yay. So we'll just leave that for now. I'll be right back. All righty. And that was the mini pottery wheel. I guess she purchased this from Amazon. They're currently unavailable for this one, but you know, you look for something this basic shape and from other websites, um, that's probably going to be the same thing. And it was pretty fun. It's a little getting used to, I'm used to like pushing down on the wheel. So this was more shaping as you saw with the trimming process. And I think it came out really cute. I can't wait to glaze it up and see how pretty they come out. So that's that for the pottery wheel. And I don't know if you've noticed, we have merchandise here. This is the Ceramic Shenanigans hoodie. I have one with this kind of logo, the one with the colored logo. There's tank tops, t-shirts, hoodies, um, a bunch of different stuff. You could go check it out at teespring.com. I'll have a link in the description below. I hope you enjoyed it. This has been Nessa. This is Ceramic Shenanigans, and I'll see you soon.